let's simplify this expression. We have subtraction and we have addition of fractions. So we need to have common denominators. What would be the least common denominator of denominators 12, 8, and 24? Well, I know 12 divides into 24 evenly and so does 8, so our least common denominator is 24. We're going to take a step then, we're going to rewrite each fraction as an equivalent fraction but with a denominator of 24. All right, keep this in mind. 12 times what number gives me 24? Well, 12 times 2 is 24, so remember the 2, that will be then 2 times 11, or 22, minus 8 times what number gives me 24? Well, 8 times 3 is 24. Now remember the 3, because I must multiply this numerator, no matter what it is, by 3. 3 times 3 is 9 plus the last fraction already has a denominator of 24. Now notice since I have common denominators, I can simply add and subtract from left to right. It will be 22 minus 9 plus 5 all over 24. Let's write that 22 minus 9 plus 5 all over 24. So what is 22 minus 9? 22 minus 9 is 13, and 13 plus 5 is 18 over 24. What's left to do is write it in simplest form. I know 18 and 24 have a common factor of 6, so let's go ahead and write 18 as 3 times 6, and 24 as 4 times 6. Then I'll divide out my common factor of 6, and I have 3 over 4. That is the answer in simplest form.